Fantastic Fantasy. The Lord of the Rings, The Fellowship of the Ring, 2001. Oh, wow. What a, what a fantasy film this is. This is what I want to be in. I want to live in forever fantasy. Fantastic for me. Uh, how could it not be? Check this movie out if you haven't seen it. Why haven't you seen it? I know it's very old, over 20-something years old. But what I still think of it today. And it puts me in a fantasy. So fantastic. The Chronicles of Narnia, The Lion, The Witch, and The Wardrobe, 2005. Isn't that a mouthful? And it sure has a full-on uh, story, full epic fantasy forever here. Fantastic at that. Uh, the scenery, cinematography, the story. These kids may be kings and queens in another world, in another fantasy world. Whoa. Uh, thank you, The Chronicles of Narnia. Ghostbusters 2, 1989. Yeah, I'm saying it. Ghostbusters 2 here. Because uh, for me, it's Ghostbusters 2. Sold in theaters back when it premiered. And I'm telling you, it was just so uh, different than the first. It was so more action packed. The music I want to point out here was just so impressionable, memorable. The music, I had the cassette tape as well. Uh, even the cool, everything was cooler, bigger on scale, more fantasy, more forever for me. And it was so fantastic to see. The Fountain, 2006. Uh, man, Hugh Jackman, Rachel we Wise here. I mean, Weeze here. It's just whatever you want to call her. She's great, beautiful. Uh, it's a shame what happens to her in this film. But you see this fantasy that they put together. It, it, for me, it's a fantasy film of, of romance completely uh, what a story they tell complete fantasy I love it uh, it's fantastic look at these words I'm using these F words I'm using um, and you will enjoy it as well it's forever for me uh, the music is, is, is one of a kind Clint Mansell he, he's a composer here you will not forget this soundtrack this music this movie put it on for a forever fantastic fantasy trust the real reviewer legend 1985 we're going with Tom Cruise back in the day in 85 uh, legend here because of the costumes here. The, the costumes, straight up. Practical costumes. This devil thing here. I believe it's Mr. Curry. Tim Curry. I don't, don't hold me to it. But I didn't want to know who it is, but pretty sure it's him behind that makeup. You don't even know who it is. He's huge. He's beastly. They have a lot of other goblins and ghouls in here with, with practical mechanics. Uh, it's just so good for 85 and today. It's a forever fantastic fantasy legend. Check it out. Forever fantastic fantasy.